The number you have dialed is not in service at this time. This new Raspberry Pi 02W. Um, it had got a bit bashed <laughs> in transportation. Um, I'm now back in the UK and um, I've got a few more things to, to try out. So this is the one with the USB hat, if you recall, uh, which works very well. And um, I decided that I'd invest in another 02W. Leave this one as it is, not fiddle with that one. So um, we have an unboxing of the new 02W. Right, firstly, I'm going to uh, put the wrist strap on and I'll be back with you shortly. Okay, back with the scissors. Right, I'm probably not going to want to reuse this bag again, so I'll just chop him up. Move that out the way. And there we have a brand new, unbashed <laughs> Zero 02W. Uh, the Postal Service in the UK is obviously a little bit more... Uh, a little bit gentler, shall we say, than the than the one in France. So there we have a new 02W. Now this unit is not going to be for my Go box. It's going to be to run with my IC705. So I thought I'd treat myself to the new case that comes available. So aluminium case with inbuilt heatsink. Keychain lanyard, blah de blah de blah. So this is the FLIRC case for the Raspberry Pi 02W specifically. Well, I'm sure it'll work with uh, 0Ws as well. So uh, let's open this up and see what we've got. Nicely packaged. Um, cardboard box, nothing more in that. And, and here is the actual case. Okay, open that up, take that out, there's the lanyard, fixing screws and a thermal pad. Well, that looks all really very simple and um, nice and small. Uh, it has a, a push-out, I guess that is, for the... Let's see if that comes off. Yes, this all comes off. I'm going to break it there. Probably those clips there need to be released. So I get a small screwdriver to do that. Okay, nothing's ever simple, is it? Never mind. <laughs> I'll just satisfy myself with installing this into the uh, into the case. So let's just have a look. It must go that way round with a slot for the SD card. The sockets line up on the outside, and um, those screw in hold everything tight. So. <laughs> There you are, that must be the smallest <laughs> cased and will go extremely well uh, with my IC705. Um, it only needing one lead uh, to communicate with the IC705. I'll just get that down. <laughs> this is going to be the smallest, I think, PC I've ever had. Uh, empty the screws and the pad uh, which I will place on there or maybe even perhaps I'll place it on the device which ones are going to go for okay I'll place it on the on the heat sink. I'll peel the other side of it off. These are always tricky to do. I don't quite know whether you're going to wreck something. I use the tweezers. Well, 
would seem to want to uh, come apart. There we go, got him. Right, so dress the unit down. Very slight resistance. And uh, apply the fixing screws. That's going well. So there's no issues with that. Alignment doesn't seem to be a problem. Um, you'll notice that uh, I've not put the socket on here. I, I'm not going to use the socket. Um, if I do need to tap anything in there, I should probably do it directly. Um, the the case comes with uh, two tops. So <laughs> the plain one that I'm going to use, uh, and this one, if you want to put a socket in, you simply swap them out. Uh, that's what uh, that's what I discovered yesterday. So final screw. You don't need to tighten these things up really tight, just gently nip them up so that uh, they're not going to rattle around. And quite amazingly, ah, <laughs> now he discovers. I'll take the screws out and we'll do that again. OK, if in doubt, read the instructions, except there were no instructions. So now I can see that, uh, in fact, the the base has recessed whoop, come here, has recessed holes to enable you to screw it down, which is uh, sensible. <laughs> I just forgot to realise. There we go. So I don't know whether you can see that, but uh, the holes line up perfectly. Um, Back. That all works. Again, don't do these up too tightly. It's absolutely not necessary. You just don't want the uh, thing falling apart. Super duper. And there we have it. <laughs> That's going to be the new control PC um, for my IC705. So uh, it's tiny. <laughs> it's absolutely minuscule. Um, and what I shall do is uh, I shall VNC into this device. So I, I won't need anything other than the connection between the uh, USB, uh, sorry, micro USB and that on the uh, 705. Incredible. Amazing. And uh, space there for putting the SIM card in. <laughs> I wonder how easy that is to uh, insert. Just take the one out of here and have a look. Oh no, I won't take that one out of there. If you remember, this was the this was the uh, previous version that was graunched by the, the French post office. I think somebody had trampled all over it, so I, I won't take that out. I'll, I'll make up a, another, uh, another uh, card, another SD card. So um, I'll get on with that, and uh, we'll move across to the PC and uh, load the necessary software to get the little Pi2W running. Isn't that cute? See you shortly. We're sorry, the number you have dialed is not in service at this time.